I'm Big Lou. It's Big Lou Barbecue. Another things I want to do. And let me tell you what I got going on for you. Well, actually for me. I, I got some chicken on the grill. Yeah, I got some uh, Big Ron's rub on that chicken too. So anyway, I'm trying it out on chicken. I tried it out on shrimp last week. It's pretty good. Did the shrimp in my air fryer. Here's a picture of that. The shrimp were real good. Anyway, now I'm trying it out on a real test, barbecue chicken, all right? Got some chicken quarters on the grill on my Old Smoky grill. By the way, I ordered this from Old Smoky uh, Products Company website. I'll have a link down below when I ordered some parts for another Old Smoky grill that I have. But this one's on my old, old Smoky grill, the Big Glue grill. You might have seen it on my channel before. No better chicken cooker than an Old Smoky 22-inch grill. Made in Houston, Texas, so what better way to cook hint of Houston chicken, all right? Anyway, I bought it, thought I'd try it out, let you know about it. Uh, I know it's been around for many years now, but I've never tried it before. And um, till I got this bottle, I think it's gonna be good on this chicken. All right, Big Ron on his website says, you just put this on about 20 minutes before you start cooking the chicken. It's been on there about 30 minutes. Just as you can see, I sprinkled it uh, real, real liberally. All right, and we're about to get it on. My favorite chicken cooker, the Old Smoky. Tell you what, you can find more expensive chicken cookers, but you're not gonna find a better one than an Old Smoky charcoal grill. All right, it's on and sizzling. Skin side down first. I'm gonna flip it over in about 20 minutes and let it go another 25 to 30 minutes till it's done. Well, that's what it looked like when it was done and that little piece at the top corner was done before the rest, so that's the one I taste tested. Well, while the other ones are finishing up in the grill, they're in the 170 range. This one's well above 180. Time to pull it off the grill, so it'll be my taste test sample. All right. If it doesn't cut easy, you're cutting in the wrong place. Well, boy, it's done. I was cutting right through the bone. This thing's so little. Look at that, look at that. I gotta come in closer. Look at this. Mmm, mmm. All right, guys, I want to tell you about this rub. Now, if you don't like cumin, you might want to stay away from this. I had to try the skin first. I don't like cumin. Not a lot of salt in this. Got that hint of heat. Mmm. Can I chicken up? Yep. Good chicken. You don't have to marinate it. I think I will next time, but you don't have to. Very good. Lots of good stuff in this rub. I know it's been around for a while, but this is my first time trying it on real barbecue. Had it on those shrimp. A lot of cumin in it. There's that hint of heat right toward the back. Not overpowering, but um, I like spicy stuff. You might want to go with the original if you don't. Well, that's good chicken. Good, good chicken. Thanks for watching Big Lou Barbecue.